of the Booktubeathon. I have just completed my book domino video challenge. The mess is still there. That was really hard. If I wasn't knocking the books over, my cats were. I am all hot and sweaty. Oh my gosh. So I did that. Yay. Um, last night I stayed up until midnight because I was so excited about the Booktubeathon starting and I completed one of the challenges, read a book without letting go of it. I read Metamorphosis by Franz Kafka. It was a short book. I enjoyed it and I am glad that I read it. Then today my son decided he wanted to go to his grandma's late last night and she lives a little bit of a distance away and I wanted to read Animal Farm which is the challenge to read someone else's favorite book. So I got it on Scribd's and I am currently in chapter 8 of 11 chapters. I'm definitely going to finish this today. I think I will probably end up reading the rest of it in my book. I was just doing that to try to keep up with my challenges. And also because my husband has a Scribd subscription and I never listen to audiobooks. So I wanted to try it. And this one has kept me interested. There were a couple times I found myself zoning out though. So I'm not sure if audiobooks are the thing for me. But I wanted to try it. So uh, for day one of the Booktubeathon, I have done one reading challenge and I have completed one book, one reading challenge, and I'm almost through with another reading challenge. I am pretty excited. I hope to keep up this momentum and hopefully I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully I will be a little less sweaty and maybe put some makeup on. Who knows? You'll have to tune in to see. Let me know how you did on day one of the Booktubeathon and catch me on Twitter. Also follow the Booktubeathon on Twitter and I will talk to you later. Bye.